and today I want to come to you to share a little tradition that my girlfriends and I adopted a few years back and we like to call it the mommy Easter basket swap. So this is basically just our little take on Secret Santa. We decided that we would meet uh, a few days prior to Easter uh, for brunch. We'd uh, pull names before we met actually and we'd meet for brunch and we would exchange Easter baskets. So we, um, after pulling names, we come up with an amount and that is the amount we stick to this year. The amount that we're going to spend on the uh, mommy Easter baskets uh, is $25. And where I like to go to shop for just little inexpensive gifts is the Dollar Tree. You know, these ladies, they don't want for anything. And it's just fun sometimes to go and shop just to kind of, I don't know, kind of cheap, cheap like. Um, like I said, they don't want for anything, and these are just little fun little gifts, I think, that um, will come in handy, but it's not going to be something that they're going to like treasure, treasure, but I think it's just really all into the thought and just the whole idea uh, of us getting together and just, you know, celebrating each other during this um, uh, wonderful holiday season that's coming up. So, let's take a look at some of the items that I bought for my mommy Easter basket swap. So the first thing that I want to share with you that I purchased for my little mommy Easter basket swap is this cute little precious little box right here. I loved it. It reminds me of spring. I love the colors on it. It's really, really shimmery. Um, I am getting over a cold and when I saw this, it just immediately perked me up. I am so over all of this cold weather. So I'm going to put a few of the items that I've purchased for her inside of this box. And so inside of the box will go... First off, these nail colors, I have pink, blue, and a dark purple. And again, all of this is from the Dollar Tree, so I really think she'll love those colors. Also going inside will be this pedicure brush, and I'll get it in there some kind of way. Um, also is this pedicure set. I love it. It's nice and blinged out and sparkly. You have clippers and files, so I think she'll enjoy that. Also going inside that box will be these two lip balms and I'm going to open all of this up and it's going to go inside. Let's see, also I got these cotton rounds. You know as lady, we, ladies we have multiple uses for these cotton rounds so you can never go wrong with those. Let's see, this microfiber hair towel. She can wrap her hair up after she gets out of the shower from washing her hair. I think she'll enjoy that. She's a natural so I can see her putting some maybe water and um, oil inside this little spray bottle. I thought that was cute and it's pink. Can't go wrong there. Let's see. Yeah, let's see a little pink bath sponge and the particular lady's name that I drew, she loves to garden. She has um, a really lovely garden um, and when I saw these gloves, these garden gloves, I immediately um, knew I had to have them. I just love the colors and they just, they really remind me of her. I love these and sticking with the garden, um, let's see, she has a little area off the side of her home where she stores all of her garden tools and seeds and plant clippings and things like that. And I thought this would be a great accessory to that little particular um, part of her house. And it says spring is in the air, little wheelbarrow with flowers and a butterfly. So I think that's cute. And the last thing I got to go inside was this whimsical little, I don't even know what it is, but I just... I really wanted it. It's just so pretty and whimsical and I love the little purple butterfly and the pink and yellow flowers. Um, I think it'll be a really, really cute addition to give the basket a little, little, um, a little pop. And so everything is going to get bundled up and placed inside this little container that again she can reuse in her garden area possibly. She can put her garden tools, those gloves and um, any other little things that um, she uses in her garden in here. So it's going to be recyclable and I'm going to put it all together with this um, pretty tissue paper and I'll be right back to show you guys how to put it together.
hope you enjoyed my little mommy Easter basket swap. And so, until next time, ladies, don't.